Hey guys, Kevin here, and this is Pure Reviews, where I review all kinds of products. So if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you find this video particularly helpful, be sure to hit that like button, maybe leave a comment before you go. It really helps with the channel a ton, and I greatly appreciate it. So today's product is available on Amazon, and there is a link in the description that will take you to the product page where you can see the current price point, see if it's on sale, all that lovely information. So what is it? It is a Pomodoro timer by a company called Tick Time. This is the box that's going to come in uh, once it arrives. And once you open it up, you're going to get, of course, a little instructions that we're going to cover, though, how you operate this thing. And then it's going to get a little USB um, to USB type, micro type A cable here um, to power it up. It does have a nice long battery life, uh, so it will last a while. When you first get it, you're going to want to charge it for... Um, several hours, like 12 hours or something like that. And then um, after that, you should just charge it every once in a while. But like I said, it does have a nice long battery. Now, this is the timer itself. So as you can see, it's this hexagonal shape. Now, what is great about this, I find this perfect for kids keeping them on tasks, whether they're doing their homework, scrubbing their teeth, um, in the bath. It's also was designed for cooking. Um, and kind of when you're cooking in uh, short meal runs, then you can easily set the timer by just flipping this. So uh, let's go over the preset. So along here, you can see all these numbers. These are the preset timer. So it starts at three minutes, five minutes, 10 minutes, 30 minutes, 25 minutes, 15 minutes, and then back down to three. And so if you have something that you need to uh, stir for five minutes, you just simply put five minutes up and then it will activate the timer and then you can see it start has a little led screen here that will start counting down the clock and then it'll beep when it is ready to go then once it's uh your five minutes up you've all said well my next dish it's going to take 15 minutes you just flip it to the 15 minutes and you're good to go again once again with my kids got homework like all right hey you need to spend 10 minutes reading so you set the 10 minutes once that's up well then you can move on to your math homework etc so it kind of helps um, time management. Uh, it's also kind of just fun to fiddle and play with. Now, it has all these little timers around the edge, but you can also manually set your own time um, by using the little buttons on the side. So you will see here, one has an M, that's for the minutes. The other one has an S, which is going to be for the seconds. So as far as a custom timer, you can set this thing all the way up to... Uh, 99 minutes and 59 seconds for a countdown. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so you got the preset or anywhere in the middle range if you so desire. Now, on the bottom here, you'll see it has like this little arrow thing. This is another cool feature. This is a count up, kind of like a stopwatch, if you will. So if you're trying to time yourself, let's say you're taking a test or something, you got to get done in a certain amount of time. Um, and you're just trying to get that time down quicker and kind of train yourself, that's what this will be perfect for. So you simply turn it over, it will start blinking, and it's going to keep track. You're not looking at the timer, so it's not going to be distracting of like, oh my gosh, it's I'm, I'm, I've been doing this for a minute. Uh, it's, it's completely hidden, and then when you're done, just flip it over, and then it is going to see how long you've spent um, right there on the easy-to-read screen. So... Now, it also, let's go over a couple other features here. It does have a slightly magnetic base uh, to help slide it around. Uh, the magnet's not that strong, so you're not going to really be able to stick it to a metal surface and have it sitting here like this, just kind of floating. Um, but it does have a somewhat magnet base, but I don't think it's really strong enough to really be useful unless you're on a slight incline. Um... It also has five different volumes. So the alarm is just a beeping sound and you can adjust the volume. How you're gonna do that is you press the button. So this one here is gonna increase the volume, which that's the loudest. And then the other one's going to bring down the volume. And then finally, the last feature is just silent where it is off. So you can customize how um, loud that uh, alarm is. And then on the front here, you'll see at the very top, there's also a little battery icon. Um, and that's going to tell you how much charge is left on the device itself. Um, now to power it off, 
Um, if you need to turn it off, you're just gonna simply have both these buttons right here. Just hold them down for, I think it's approximately two or three seconds, and then it will turn off and you're good to go. To turn it back on, just hit one of the buttons and then it will return on again and you're ready to go. And then right there at the top, you can see it, that is where you are going to plug it in to charge up. Now, when it is charging, it is not gonna function as a timer, so just keep that in mind. You cannot have it um, plugged in and counting down for you if you are trying to do that. And on the bottom there is the little speaker that makes the sound. But that is overall um, the ins and outs of this little cool timer. So like I said, it makes it's great for keeping yourself on task. Uh, it's easy to use in the kitchen because you just rotate it. You don't have to uh, do all these manual settings because it has, I mean, pretty much all the common um, times that you would expect to utilize. If there was something that I didn't cover that you're curious about, feel free to hit me up in the comment section. I do typically respond to those, and be sure to check out the link in the description to see the current price points, see if it's in sale, all that lovely stuff. And that is it. So until the next video, you guys take it easy. Later. Congrats, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much. Um, greatly appreciated for the support. Be sure to uh, hit that like button on the video. It really, really does help out. And if you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you want to uh, get notified when new videos come out on this channel.